Hey hi, this is Manjuna Chandriya. Today I'll be learning how to use some product with some function. So basically, I have a data with the sales name, sales person name, the product, and the sales number of sales he has done. So I have just taken one person sales, and the product name is TV sets. Let's try to get the information. So for that, you can use the sum if function. So sum ifs use sum if function open bracket insert function. Say it's sum range. So the sum is we are summing up the sales. Use F4 to log the sales. Criteria range. So we are looking for the sales person name. F4 log the sales criteria. So we are uh, we are looking for the person sales person name is Ram. So criteria two. We are looking for the products. So criteria it says criteria range. So you select the range for the products. To F4 to log these cells. If F4 is not working, use function key F4. And the criteria to use is nothing but we are looking for the product T. So as already you can see the value is picking up here. Yes. So now I got the 30 is the product what Ram has sold. So if I change it to Sam, he has sold 25 sets of TV. So let's say. But Ram is not only selling TV, but he is also selling mobile phones as well as the AC. He is selling three products here. So I need to know like how many uh, is uh, any other product he is selling. Let's say I'll put mobile phone mobile here. So we are trying to get two criteria to find Ram whether is how many is sold for both the criteria. So so here if you do double click on this, here you can see. The range what we selected for the sum if so that would be so this was your second criteria the first criteria is for the name column E is for the name the we are looking for the products the product range is F column and the criteria two is nothing but we have selected L4 L4 is nothing but the TV sets but we need to know the as well as mobile so what you can do here you can go just delete this criteria two just select the range of these two. So I've selected L4 to LM. So just click OK. So still it gives you 30, but it is not showing the values of mobile. For that, what you can do, just double click on it. Just add some product in the prior to the sum if open bracket and you close the bracket here again. Hit enter. So now you can see it shows 68 for both the set. Let's check. TV is 30 and the mobile phone so what ROM has sold is 33. 33 plus 30, 68. And I think RAM would have sold again some mobile mobile phones here. So here. So this 3 is totaling up to 68. So now you can see it's taking 68. Let's add AC here. So I need to select the range. So just double click. So if you you can go ahead and change it here. If you are not familiar, just click on it. Already we have taken it. So just go to this F column L L4 to LM. So just change it to N. So range is takes from L4 to L L N7. So N4 is it enter. Now see AC RAM has sold here. So when you total it this this and this this will get 73 so you can increase n number of uh, your criteria here just change the name let's say I'll change to Sam so Sam has sold maybe he doesn't have any AC so he has only TV sets so here Sam mobile phones and mobile phones 100 so you can able able to get the all the information based on the multiple criteria for the same column. So this is this column, but we are looking for these three products. So it is something I'm giving. Just you need to add the sum product uh, prior to the sum if function. I hope uh, this formula was helpful. Please uh, do uh, comment. Uh, let me know which uh, whichever formula you like to learn so that I can prepare a video on it. Thank you for your time.